Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving if you're unable to open up disk management on your Windows 11 computer. So I can imagine this would be a frustrating issue. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the search menu and type in services. Best match, come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. You want to scroll down to the virtual disk service and double click on it. You want to set startup type to automatic. And if service status is stopped, you want to select the start option. You want to make sure startup type is set to manual. And if service status is stopped, you want to select the start option. So again, you want to make sure startup type is manual and service status is running. Select apply and OK. And then attempt to open up disk management again and then hopefully your issue should have been resolved. So one further thing we can try here, if we close out of here and open up the search menu, type in PowerShell. Best match should come back with Windows PowerShell. Go ahead and right click on that and select Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select Yes. And now I will have a command in the description of my video, guys. I want you to copy it and then go up the top bar of the Windows PowerShell window, right click on it, select Edit, and then select Paste to paste it in. And then once that's done, go ahead and close out of here. Attempt to open up disk management once again, and then hopefully your problem should have been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.